Hello fire signs, welcome to your weekly reading. So these messages will be for October 30th through November 6th. Happy Halloween for those who celebrate. So let's go ahead and tap into your energy. Spirit, give me some overall messages for the fire signs for the week of October 30th through November 6th. What do they need to focus on? What can they expect? Fire signs. Oh, I have community. First thing that I heard was gossip. So for some of you, there could be some type of gossip going on around you within a community of people. This can be family, friends, at work. Um, I feel like with the butterflies, whatever this is, I feel like this is meant to change you, change your perspective on who it is that you surround yourself with. Yeah, opportunity at the bottom of the deck. This is like an opportunity for you to re-examine your life. I'm also getting for some of you, you could be dealing with somebody who is an opportunist, who is trying to take advantage of you monetarily. So definitely be um, careful here, fire signs. Let's get another energy. Spirit, give me another message for the fire signs. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, please. What's going on? What's going on with the fire signs? Health. I will honor the physical vessel that enshrines my soul. I feel like for some of you, I'm just hearing like take care of yourself. So fire signs, make sure you're like you're taking care of your health here. Mental, emotional, physical health, spiritual health. Um, make sure you're not overindulging. Make sure you're not drinking a lot, having a little bit too much fun and um, not really taking care of your vessel. Pride. I love myself and I see myself in everyone. For some of you, I feel like there's somebody around you that could be sick or this could be you. Somebody may not be disclosing this because of their pride. Somebody may be in the energy of not wanting people to feel sorry for them. With this community, you may feel the need to reach out to family or friends to really help you through this difficult period in your life here, Fire Signs. Yeah, somebody could be sick here. I'm getting like um, somebody's mother. So yeah, definitely reach out. If this is you or a family member, you know, make sure you, you have support around you as you go through this. I'm grieving. I'm getting grieving. Somebody could be grieving here. A loss. So definitely my condolences. Let's go ahead and tap into some more energy. Spirit, give me some more messages for the fire signs. More energy for the fire signs, please. I'm also getting a sister as well for someone. Oh, I have the seventh chakra, Archangel Uriel. Let's get some more messages. Cornucopia. Wow. I'm hearing every time I turn around. Blessings, blessings. So this is definitely going to be um a very abundant week for you. I feel like your intuition is going to be on overflow here. You're going to be receiving a whole bunch of downloads. Door to spirit at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, spirit God is really going to be communicating with you. I'm also getting something about a recipe. So for some of you, you may be cooks. You may be um, deciding to start a cooking channel or this is something you're going to be thinking about. Give me some more energy, please. Another message for the fire signs. Happy family. So somebody could be finding out that they're pregnant here. Somebody um could be experiencing certain symptoms. And it's like with the seven chakra, like you already know you have an inkling that you are pregnant, but it's just confirmation that is needed. Yeah, somebody could be adding to their family. So congratulations. And look what's at the bottom of the deck. Can't make this up. Second chakra, Archangel Ariel. Yeah. For some of you with this door to value, um, I feel like whatever it is that you do as far as your gifts, your talents, you're definitely going to start to see it pay off monetarily. You are going to have an influx of money coming to you here, Fire Signs. So continue to be creative here. Continue to use your gifts. You are about to come into the overflow. Spirit, tell me about the seventh chakra, Archangel Uriel. Yeah, um, the title card. You're going to be receiving a lot of messages here. And I just keep hearing community gossip. Like, 
for some of you you're going to be getting a lot of um downloads like in your dreams that there are people around you who really do not have your best interest at heart there's people talking about you give me another energy on seven chakra for the fire signs why second seven chakra here yeah the eight of pentacles this could be people that you work with I'm also getting, you're going to be getting a lot of ideas pertaining to work. For some of you, you could be deciding to start a new project here. Yeah, but there's a lot going on around you, fire signs, that you don't know about. I feel like, again, you feel something's off, but you just can't put your finger on it. And this is why, like, there's people talking about you. Yeah, yeah. Give me an energy on the title card. The Five of Pentacles. So for some of you, people could be talking about your stability here. You could be going like through a really rough time. Somebody could um, not have a place to stay. Your finances could be negatively impacted. And a lot of people have something to say. Give me another energy on the title card. Why is the title card here? The King of Cups. So we have a water sign masculine here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Give me an energy on the Eight of Pentacles. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? So I have the Six of Cups, but in the reverse. Give me an energy on the Eight of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles. So listen, there's a group of people here that collaborated together in the past. So this has to do with the past here. This community gossip that I keep hearing. Um, this is something that took place a while ago for some of you. Give me some energy. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? The Three of Cups. Give me one more on the Five of Pentacles. For the fire signs, the emperor. So for some of you, you could be um, finding out that somebody is definitely in a third party situation or has you in a third party situation, I should say, this emperor Aries energy. But it's like now this person is in lag, like they don't have anything. I heard they don't have anything left to their name. Give me an energy on this king of cups the star give me another energy on the king of cups for the fire signs somebody could be sick the queen of wands so it's going to be exposed <laughs> this week who this masculine was entertaining when it comes to third parties. Somebody um was sleeping around here. Yeah, it's going to be exposed about a relationship. Like between a water sign, masculine, fire sign, feminine here. For some of you, they don't have to have these placements. But exposure is coming about a workplace relationship. Somebody could have ended up getting fired for this or will be getting terminated here. Give me um, fraternizing, if I said that right. Somebody definitely um, did a lot of things outside of the job. Clarifying the Six of Cups. So this is somebody's judgment. This is somebody karma for what took place in the past. Give me energy on the ten of pentacles why is the ten of pentacles here strength give me another energy on the ten of pentacles oh the ace of swords so people are about to find out the truth and it's going to be a lot of people finding out the truth yeah it this is exposure season again community gossip so there's going to be a lot to talk about. A lot of truths are coming out. Give me something on this Ace of Swords. Why is the Ace of Swords here?
the nine of pentacles The Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. So listen. The truth about who you are and who someone else is, is going to be exposed. So for some of you, you're showing up in this Nine of Pentacles energy. Somebody who's very stable, abundant, self-sufficient. And somebody else is showing up in an energy where um, they're codependent. They don't manage their money well. So it's like the people around... You and this other energy, they're going to be able to see who's who. They're going to be able to see who's the stable one and who's not. Give me an energy on the Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Oh, the Devil. Capricorn energy. The Queen of Cups. So we have the King and the Queen of Cups here. Two counterparts. Give me an energy on the devil. Why is the devil here? I just feel like this was a huge collaboration of a lot of people. But again, they're going to see who's who. The Ten of Swords. So there was definitely some type of betrayal here. Give me another energy on the devil. Two of Swords. So I feel like somebody was betraying you behind your back, but you didn't know anything about this here, fire signs. I feel like with this, everything is fine. You were definitely able to move past this situation. Give me an energy on the Queen of Cups. The Two of Wands. And give me another energy on the Queen of Cups. The Page of Cups. So something definitely deals with a child here at a distance. So somebody um, has a child. Give me an energy on the page of cups. Somebody could be pregnant. The harmony, a secret child. Okay, so the ten of swords. So there's truth coming out about a betrayal here revolving around a secret child. Somebody got someone pregnant at a distance or have a child at a distance that people are unaware of. So wow, it's a lot coming out this week. So we have somebody who likes to sleep around third parties secrets are going to come out about who this person was dealing with and sleeping with on a job this person may end up losing their job if they haven't already then we have competition here they're going to see who's who who's the stable one nine of pentacles versus the queen of pentacles in the reverse and then we have somebody who betrayed you behind your back the truth is going to come out about that betrayal and then we have somebody over here with a secret child at a distance in another state another part of the city here and this was also a betrayal so we have two tens ten tens so i feel like there's definitely going to be a huge bang explosion this week surrounding all kind of secrets i feel like yeah, there's just a whole lot of things that are coming to the surface. Give me an energy on the Ten of Swords. Why is this Ten of Swords here for the fire signs? The Four of Cups. So this person rejected you here? Yeah, this is somebody who rejected you. But something's a struggle. Yeah. Something's going to be explosive here. Somebody has a lot to deal with. I'm also getting somebody feels remorse. Give me an energy on the hermit. Yeah, nine of wands. Somebody's trying to protect this from coming out. So, a lot of people have a lot going on, but, but it seems like the truth is going to be seen about you and the truth is going to be seen about these people, whether it's people you work with, family, but this is exposure season here. Give me an energy on cornucopia. The full Aquarius energy. Give me another energy on cornucopia. Oh, the king of pentacles. All right. Why is the full here? Clarifying cornucopia. The four of wands. 
in the hermit. So somebody's married here or somebody wants to commit to you. They want to build a family with you. Somebody wants to come towards you here, fire signs, or you want to go towards someone and have a commitment. Give me something on this King of Pentacles. Why is this King of Pentacles here? The Eight of Swords. Injustice. Somebody's in jail. Somebody is in jail. Wow. And somebody is definitely pregnant. The world to the Page of Wands to the Ace of Cups, the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody has been juggling here. Somebody could also be going through a divorce. Yeah, but somebody's locked up. Somebody's incarcerated. Give me an energy on um another energy on this King of Pentacles. Somebody was very greedy. Why is the King of Pentacles here? Ooh, and somebody could have put you in competition. Give me an energy on the Four of Wands. Why is the Four of Wands here? Why is the Four of Wands here for fire signs? The Six of Pentacles. Yeah, so somebody breadcrumbed you. They were given to someone else. This person could have already been in a commitment. But this is somebody that likes to take leaps of faith everywhere with anybody. Yeah. This person felt like they could do whatever they wanted to do. But somebody don't got hemmed up here. Somebody's very greedy. Um, give me one more on the Four of Wands. The Magician. Give me one more on the Magician, Virgo, Gemini Energy, the Hierophant. So, someone could have like manipulated a situation or forced someone to marry them, to commit to them so that they could be taken care of. Yeah, somebody literally married somebody just for money, for finances. And whoever this person got married to, they're they're getting locked up. They're going to jail. Give me another energy on this Eight of Swords. The Knight of Wands. Yeah, somebody's very childish and immature. Somebody does things without thinking. And whatever this person did, like, yeah, um, they're going away here for a certain amount of time. This could have been due to some type of fight or altercation that took place. Give me an energy on Happy Family. Why is Happy Family here for the fire signs? The Tower. Ooh, so something's coming to an end. Scorpio Energy. The Knight of Cups. Give me another energy on the Tower. The Three of Swords. Okay, yeah, third party situation here. Somebody was like a lover boy, lover girl. Like to take offers everywhere. Somebody, um, marriage is coming apart here. Give me an energy on the Knight of Cups. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Ooh, the Empress in the reverse. Wow. So whoever this person is married to is very toxic and low vibrational. Yeah, this is somebody who's not stable whatsoever. Who don't have good balance over their emotions. Don't make good decisions. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Give me an energy on the Knight of Wands. The Knight of Swords. Yeah, somebody got into a fight. Yeah, somebody kind of flew off the handle here. Somebody has a temper. Yeah. Yeah, so that's why someone is getting locked up. Give me something on this Hierophant. Why is the Hierophant here? The Four of Swords. Somebody could have also got married while they were under the influence. And they don't remember even getting married to this person. Something just could have been like a, um, oh my goodness, I can't think of the word. It'll come to me. Give me another energy on the higher front. Why is the higher thing here? The Six of Swords. Now somebody's ready to leave. Somebody's ready to walk away from this. Uh-uh, no. Somebody took that leap of faith and ended up in the Six of Swords. Like, what have I done yeah, somebody married someone really quick without thinking about it. And for some of you, this person was under the influence when they got married. And it's like, now they're like, whoa, wait a minute. 
what have I done here? Yeah, somebody's leaving someone. They're walking away. Her recollection. Yeah, somebody don't remember <laughs> even getting married to this person. Wow. Alrighty. So it just seems like a whole community of people is like going through a lot of drama in their life right now. There's a lot of upheaval, a lot of endings, a lot of exposure. It's like a whole community of people are under judgment. Let me get a final message. Spirit, give me some final messages on this reading. The sun, Leo energy, give me a final message on this reading. <laughs> wow, heavy on the Leo strand. The four of swords. So somebody is sick here. Um, fire signs, this could be you or, or someone, you know, around you currently. But whoever this person is that's sick, they're going to pass away here. Give me, what is the reason for this message spirit? Let me ask that. Justice, Libra energy. What is the reason for this reading? The Knight of Wands. What is the reason for this reading? Ah, the Seven of Wands. So these people, yeah, are under judgment. They're going through karma. These people um, acted in haste. They did something without thinking. And it's like they had no protection. They have no protection. So it's like God is allowing everything in their life to fall apart, is allowing them to go through karma, hardships, a lot of disruption here. They have no protection. Give me something on justice. Why is justice here? For the fire signs. The Eight of Cups. I just heard they should have walked away. Give me an energy on the Knight of Wands. Yeah, there was a lot of negative gossip here. A lot of rumor, slander, a lot of people trying to compete with you here. Le Le oh, I was going to say Libra. So somebody could definitely have Libra highly aspected. Give me an energy on the Seven of Wands. Why is the Seven of Wands here in the reverse? The Three of Wands. Give me one more on the Seven of Wands. One more on the seven of wands in the reverse. The emperor. Because God is the judge. That's what I'm getting. God is the judge. So these people could have tried to judge you. Slander you. Talk bad about you. But it's like they, they should have walked away. They had a chance to walk away. But they didn't. So it's like now God is the judge. They're being judged. Everybody's under judgment. That's what this is. A community of people are under judgment. Health. I will honor the physical vessel that enshrines my soul. They didn't honor themselves. Like they pretty much sold their soul here. So let's get one more final message. Spirit, give me one more final message for the fire signs. Be where you are. Every situation has its gift. To move forward, we must first honor where we are for now. Where you are is where you need to be. So yes. So fire signs, like whatever it is that happened, and somebody definitely does have a, a significant Libra placement because I just heard Libra again. Um, it was a blessing in disguise.
nothing is wasted no experience here so just use this as something to help you grow learn from it and for these people this is definitely a learning experience for them as well they are going to grow from this trust me and then at the bottom of the deck i have give freely support others give expecting nothing in return so yes and what stands out to me is support others yeah has somebody abided by the golden rule treat others as you want to be treated then we would not be here so this is justice so fire signs this is your message i hope it resonates stay true to thyself and real with thyself grow with me as i grow with you stay blessed